Hey everybody, it's Lisa, owner of Peaches Skincare. You can visit us at peachesskincare.com. And I also invite you to follow us on Instagram or Facebook to see a little bit more about who we are and our or my holistic Lisa skincare. Um, I'm 55, almost 56 years old. I say it in every video because so many people comment. Um, I don't wear any foundation or concealer and no, I have done nothing invasive to my skin. No Botox, no injectables, no nothing. This is me and this is what I can help you to accomplish with your skin, whether you're acneic and young or prematurely aging. Um, a couple of you have asked me about the Nira laser. So about six months ago, Nira reached out to me and asked if they could send me their Nira laser. Now, if you know anything about me, I've worked in doctor's offices, doctors refer to me. I don't believe in lasers and I don't love them. There's ablative and non-ablative. Um, think of it as injury and non-injury. And essentially what they say is you go in, you have laser done, you actually see the white or the burning of your skin and your skin starts to heal itself and so it creates collagen. But what they don't tell you is that it completely changes the color and tone of your skin, which for some people might think it's good, but that doesn't last. You have to keep chasing that laser burn and your skin doesn't like it. It burns it and maybe it starts to heal it underneath, but what we see is that it actually damages the skin so much that I think people start to age quicker and they actually look like they have aged more. Now, mind you, I have seen clients for almost 40 years. So it's like a science experiment. I get to see what Botoxes and lasers and everything do. And I am telling you, they age faster and it looks like they age faster. So a non-ablative or a non-injury laser is something that um, a lot of people were trying to create for at-home use. And there were different people talking about it for the past, I'd say, eight years or so um, because laser got so popular. And when Nira came out with it, I wasn't really sure. I thought, wow, I'm not sure if this is going to be something that is going to work. But, um, and I always like to say, I take very good care of my skin. And so before you purchase anything extra, frosting on the cake, take care of your skin, use good skincare, wear a wide brimmed hat in the sun, but take good care of your skin. And then these things are going to give you a better result. Also, if you keep covering your face up with foundation and concealer every day, you're really going to inhibit your skin from being better, from being healthier. So let me show you how I use the Nira laser. Um, I love how streamlined it is. It's very well made. Um, it comes with a little cord so that I would say I probably only need to charge it. It seems like monthly. They may say it's more, but I don't think it's, um, I think it's only monthly. On clean skin, I um, like to do the Nira and I typically do it in the morning. So clean skin for me is I've exfoliated. I've cleansed my face. I might even use my polish. I do use my polish. I don't know why I say I might. I do all of the regime. And if you're curious about a peaches regime, just go to our website, go to the FAQ page, and you can download the prescription sheet. And that gives you a guideline of what we or I recommend at peaches. And you can use your own products and hey, call me, talk with me. We can do a um, consultation and I can help you. But I go to my polish and then I go to my, um, Let's see, I get out of the shower and I do my toner. So I do do my apple cider vinegar and I do, um, and that's about it. I don't do my toner. I do my toner after I use my Nira. Now, what it you do is you just push the little button and you, um, I like to go all the way to the very highest amount. I'm always trying to do the highest because I want to make sure it's not going to hurt any of you. And I started by just using it on my forehead. So you hit it and you hear a beep. If you hear it make a longer beep, it means it hasn't made a connection. So you go across, I like to go across my forehead. I go to the other side, all across this area. I do my 11s like so, so you can hear it. And I just do my 11s. 
Now, I do do under my eyelid because that was really what Nero was trying to focus on. I don't know that I've seen a huge difference, but I lift my eye and I just go under my eyelid like so. And I probably do it about three times out to the end. Then I take it and I go under my eye like so. Now, because I know the bands of muscles go all the way back to my hairline, I many times like to start back here with the firming effect and I'll just go right along my eye. I go to the other side and then I go to these labial folds and I just go down, right down the folds all the way on both sides. Now, every once in a while I might go over my lip. It's where I had melasma as a young woman. I've gotten rid of it by the way I do my, my skincare, but just to be sure I might go over my lip. Um, but that's really all I do with the Nera. Now I have tried it on different parts of my face. I have had no issues to turn it off. You just hold it and it just completely turns off. I have had no issues and I have to tell you, I think the changes are really remarkable. I'm going to go ahead and try and put in a before and after. My before and after is also, however, from me doing massaging, from me building collagen naturally in my skin. But it's also to show you that I think that the Nera really has value and I think it's something worth purchasing and worth putting your money into. There aren't a lot of tools that I recommend. Um, but this is one that I think would be the frosting on the cake. So I hope that this gave you some insight in how the Nera works. I didn't get into the chemistry of it or the, um, uh, the engineering of it. Um, I think it's important for you to do your homework and to go to the Nera website, see how they say it works. But I like to show you the um, layman's terms of things. I want to just show you the real reality of it because so many people give you so much knowledge on things that really do nothing. And a lot of times holistic is just a leap of faith and trying something natural. So this is a non-injury laser. It does create collagen at a lower level, like a one in two, one in three collagen. And I really have seen a difference, but I take very good care of my skin. I hope you all enjoyed this and I hope you all stay beautiful naturally.